I told my boy go on like ten blunts for me. Hey guys, what's happening and welcome back to our channel. He was selected amongst XXL Magazine's annual freshman class in 2019 alongside Roddy Rich, The Baby and Megan The Stallion to spotlight the rap game's most up-and-coming artists. Later that year, Lil Mosey's second album, Certified Hitmaker, reached number 12 on the US charts. However, as of late, He's been up to some fishy stuff, which has left both his fan base and the fellow rappers in the industry in utter shock. Let's see why Lil Mosey is on the run from police. Number 4. Who is Lil Mosey? Moses Lathan Stanley Eccles, better known by his stage name Lil Mosey, is an American rapper, musician, and songwriter who was born on January 25, 2002. With the success of his song Pull Up in late 2017, he immediately shot to fame. Notice, Mosey's first Billboard Hot 100 charting track appeared on his debut studio album North's Best 2018. Certified Hitmaker 2019, his second studio album, debuted at number 12 on the US Billboard 200. In 2020, Mosey released Blueberry Fago, his highest charting song to date, which reached number 8 on the Billboard Hot 100. Moses Lathan Stanley Eccles was born in Mount Lake Terrace, Washington on January 25, 2002 to a white mother and a half Puerto Rican, half African American father. On the north side of Seattle, he was raised by his mother. He began rapping when he was in his early teens and his music career began when he was in the 8th grade. Eccles attended Mount Lake Terrace High School until the 10th grade when he moved to Shortcrest High School. Following the popularity of his song Pull Up, he dropped out of school and pursued his music career, moving to Los Angeles to record. It's the Lamazis here. Dun, 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 young Mazi. Number 3. What happened? In the state of Washington, Lil Mosey is in serious trouble. He's been charged with abuse and a warrant for his arrest has been issued after he failed to show up for a court appearance. The pullback rapper was set to testify in court on April 21st on Wednesday, just weeks after being charged with abuse in the second degree. Mosey is said to have never shown up. As a result, he is now a wanted man. This all stems from an alleged event in January in which a woman alleges she and a friend went to a cabin to see Mosey but were assaulted by him and another man. Kiss. Give him, look, give him a kiss. She's not trying to give him a kiss, bro. She's scared. She want to give him a kiss for life. Number two, why is Mosey on the run? According to the affidavit received by TMZ, one of the alleged victims agrees to sit in a car with Mosey but then claims she blacked out in the cabin after drinking white cloths and champagne. Mosey allegedly jumped on top of her and began yanking her legs up and apart while abusing her, she says. She said that when Mosey was moving her thighs, she felt pain in her leg muscles. She claimed she blacked out once more and awoke to see the other guy holding her. The woman claims she was injured with bruises on her arms, leg and in her knee in the affidavit. She also says she received a note from one of the party goers claiming the guys were about quote unquote training two girls. Number one, what's next? A warrant has been released for the 19 year old Seattle native, real name Lathan Eccles, whose hit Blueberry Fago charted in the top 10 in both the United States and the United Kingdom last year. Abuse in the second degree has been levied against him and another man, Francisco Prater. On Wednesday, April 21st, both refused to show up for a preliminary hearing in Washington. He could face a maximum sentence of life in prison if found guilty. His manager was contacted by the BBC in hopes of reaching out to him safely and made him plead guilty to save some years off his sentence. Eccles was given a $50,000 warrant for his arrest on April 21st, 2021 after he refused to appear in court for a preliminary hearing. 
Eccles' solicitor argued that he failed to testify because the court order was sent to an address Eccles had not served at for five years and because he was unaware of the preliminary hearing until after the warrant was given. But what do you guys think about Little Mosey's career? Do you think he can still bounce back from all of this or do you think it's all gone and done with? Whatever your thoughts are, be sure to leave us a like, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon if you enjoyed the content of this video and you wish to be updated about Lil Mosey in the future. And with that, I'll catch you guys later in another video. Bye now!